Now, in the last two decades, what has happened? Corneal transplantation has gone under tremendous advancement. So what we are doing these days is a customized corneal transplantation surgery. So previously, it was an overkill therapeutics, like for even the anterior disease where the posterior part of the cornea was normal, we were doing a full thickness corneal transplantation. Nowadays, we just do selective layer by layer corneal transplantation. So for the anterior diseases, we do deep anterior lamellar keratoplasty, and for the posterior diseases, we do DSAC for the fixed dystrophy. And in Australia, we introduce completely a sutureless DSAC where no stitches are involved, and it is so good and comfortable to the patient. It also reduces a lot of surgical complications and post-operative complications which were previously associated with a full thickness corneal transplantation. So all these new techniques which are being successfully done take away a lot of complications of corneal transplantation which were associated earlier with a full thickness corneal transplantation. So full thickness corneal transplantations are only done in cases where cornea is in all the layers of the cornea are involved. Otherwise, we do these selective, customized corneal transplantation. By that I mean for every patient, we design, we devise a strategy of corneal transplantation. So it's not like one treatment being applied to everybody. It is an individual-based treatment as related to the modern corneal transplantation surgery.